Hello guys, it's a Zai, Zyap guy. We all have our distinct styles of doing stuff. The same goes for programming as well. Our programming styles are all different. But in this video, I will show you the types of programming styles. Before I get into the video, we are very close to 40k subs, so if you like this, please subscribe. The YOLO. This type of programmer thinks of nothing before starting. They open their IDE and start typing. It's usually a... Uh, yeah, it doesn't go too well. Uh, I really want to try making a small text adventure game. I mean, I don't have a story of any kind in mind, but... Uh, actually, I don't even know if I can make one. It can't be that hard, right? I should just start a Python and try out. The Overplanner. It's good to plan things. As I said like 20 seconds ago, not planning is bad. Just like anything, having or doing too much of something is just as bad as doing too little of something. Over planning can hurt your productivity as much as under planning. Time to make a calculator. I think it would be wise to plan this out before starting. What type of calculator should I use? Hmm. Now, should it be simple? Should it be scientific? Maybe something with a built-in scripting system for functions, so... Uh, I think I need to include some sort of graphing system. Uh, but now that I think of it, using Python could lead to easier development, but still, yeah, C++ is quite faster than Python, so... I can't really decide. I could say Steam, but would anyone download a calculator from Steam? It doesn't make any sense. Ugh, screw it. I don't want to make a calculator. Damn. Vintage Nostalgia Lord. Ah, uh, the 90s. Such a good time. Tech was evolving. People were happy. I wasn't alive. Instead of admiring modern technology and how easy it is to use, some of us just like the olden days for some reason. The senior developer style. Look, using tips and tricks you found on Stack Overflow does not make you a senior programmer. Although, you can still act like one. This is what someone who uses the senior developer style does. Time to start this new project, it is gonna be amazing! I have so many ideas planned. Hmm, wait. What about a senior programmer do in this case? Hmm, I don't think they would use an IDE, they would just use a text editor. Yeah, a text editor would be far better. Actually, wait, now that I think of it... What kind of a senior developer would use a text editor? They'd obviously just all use Vim! Haha! <laughs> Time to use Vim. At last, we have the worst one. Everyone, say hello to the hacker. Oh no! The hacker is the worst of them all. They go ahead and watch hacker movies like Swordfish and think they are this huge hacker that controls everything. These people are the type to doxy and call themselves hackers. They're usually some 12 year old living in their mother's basement.
programming styles aside, if you want to know what's the best style of learning, it's by doing it yourself. That's why this video is sponsored by Brilliance.org. Learn interactively with Brilliance fun hands-on lessons in math, science, and computer science. Interactive learning helps you learn six times more effectively than watching lecture videos. Brilliant starts by explaining why the concept matters and what's it all about using interactive visuals, rather than just solving repetitive and boring problems. They teach you the intuitive ideas behind topics like algebra, statistics, algorithms, and much more. You'll come to understand how STEM actually works and how it's relevant to your everyday life. Also, Brilliant has lots of great courses for all ability and knowledge levels. Master all sorts of technical subjects, with topics ranging from calculus fundamentals to quantum computing to artificial neural networks. Brilliant's courses on geometry and trigonometry have really helped me out at school. Instead of a long, boring paragraph, Brilliant teaches you through interactive problem solving. Brilliant has helped me become a better student and a better programmer. So what are you waiting for? Join the millions of people already learning on Brilliant with a special offer just for you listeners. Check out the link in the description to get started for free with Brilliant's interactive lessons. The first 200 listeners will also get 20% off an annual membership. So hurry up. Thank you all so much for watching. Just like in my last video, I tried to structure this video like one of my older ones. Leave a like if you enjoyed it. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe and hit the bell. We are so close to 40k subs and it would be amazing if we could hit that milestone before summer. Join my discord and check out my twitter. Anyways, enough selling out, see y'all later, Zyp guy out.